Understanding Good Time Credit in English. Hello, everyone. In today's video, we're going to dive into a fascinating phrase in English Good Time Credit. This term is especially relevant in legal and correctional contexts. But it's also a great example of how specific phrases can have very specialized meanings in English. So, let's explore what good time credit means and how it's used. Stay tuned to learn something new. Good time credit is a legal term used primarily in the context of prisons and corrections. It refers to the reduction of an inmate's prison sentence as a reward for good behavior. The key idea here is that prisoners can earn an earlier release date by following rules and participating in positive activities while incarcerated. This concept is crucial in many justice systems around the world, as it promotes rehabilitation and good conduct among prisoners. To understand good time credit better, let's look at some examples of how it's used in sentences. 1. The inmate received good time credit for his participation in educational programs. 2. Good time credit can significantly shorten a prisoner's sentence if they maintain good behavior. 3. The new law changes how good time credit is calculated for inmates. In each example, the phrase is directly related to the prison system and involves reducing a sentence based on positive actions or behavior. Understanding phrases like good time credit is vital for English language learners, particularly those interested in legal, governmental, or correctional fields. It shows how English can have very specific terms for particular contexts. Learning such phrases enhances comprehension and helps in understanding the nuances of the language, especially in professional or specialized environments. I hope this video has been enlightening and has expanded your understanding of the English language, particularly the phrase, good time credit. Remember, English is full of specialized terms and phrases that can be quite intriguing to learn. Keep exploring, and you'll discover the richness and diversity of this language. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.